Welcome to MBBS Council. UGC Chairman Jagdish Kumar told that they are working on a proposal to integrate the engineering and medical entrances into the common university entrance test CUET. In this video, we will see whether it is going to affect NEET repeaters. If you are new to this channel, subscribe to this channel now so that you never miss any NEET counseling update. JEE, NEET and CUET are the three major entrance exams in India which are taken by more than 43 lakh students across India. UGC says the idea behind merging these three exams is to reduce the burden of student to appear in multiple exams. CUET which is taken by 15 lakh candidates is conducted for 10 days by National Testing Agency. For JEE session 1 which was taken by 8 lakh candidates, it took 7 days for NDA to conduct the exam. The question papers of all these entrance exams are strictly based on NCRT syllables and are in multiple choice format. There is not much difference between the assessment process of NEET, JEE and CUET. The only difference is NEET, which is still an OMR based and not computer based. In case of NEET exam, it is conducted in one day across India because it is conducted in pen and paper mode. The proposal is to merge JEE, NEET and CUET and conduct the exam as computer based test. The existing infrastructure can currently accommodate 1 lakh candidates to write computer based tests simultaneously. To accommodate 50 lakh candidates with the existing infrastructure, it will take 50 days to complete the exam itself. NTA should work to scale the infrastructure at least 10 times within one year if it wants to merge all three entrance exams during 2023. When NTA official was asked about this, he replied that once the committee is formed and after it submits its recommendation, NTA will start preparing for the integrated exam. This means it is not likely to happen in 2023 because there is very less time available for the next admission season. UGC also understands that significant percentage of candidates who write entrance exam are repeaters. Moreover, National Education Policy 2020 talks about one nation, one entrance in order to reduce students' burden of taking multiple entrance exam for higher education. UGC might have made this proposal public just to see the reaction of different stakeholders such as IIT, state-run universities and colleges, private colleges, coaching centers, students as well as parents. Question paper and difficulty level for JE and NEET are different. Merging these two exams will impose a lot of challenges. Reaching common consensus will take a lot of time as each exam gives different weightage to subjects. Earlier, when AIMS and JIPMER entrance exam were conducted separately apart from the NEET exam, there were many issues in merging these exams. AIMS exam was tougher because of assertion and reason questions and JIPMER included language and reasoning questions. During 2020, it was finally merged and the question paper difficulty level was brought down so that BDS and AYUS courses can also be accommodated within NEET. Similarly, JEE, NEET and CUET will be merged one day, but it is not likely to happen during NEET 2023, but it may happen during 2024 or 25. Let's say if you are planning to appear for NEET 2024, should you be worried? No. When AIMS and NEET were merged, the difficulty level of the question paper came down. Similarly, when NEET is merged with CUET, the difficulty level will further come down. This brings us to the end of this video. If you have any NEET counseling related doubts, comment below to get an answer. See you in the next video.